a new hero. We're gonna try KT. We're gonna try Kael'thas, a Sunstrider. So with Kael'thas, trying to show you guys hero power, pretty much it's a passive. For every third minion you buy, they get 2-2. Two, two. So he's kind of like, he's kind of like Yogg, but it's not random. It's more targeted, I guess, right? Because Yogg is random. So we're gonna try him out. We have not tried him yet. So this will be the first, first attempt with Kael'thas. <laughs> yeah, Corny, just try it out. Try the first chapter. It's free. You may as well. All right, new hero. So yeah, is every third minute you buy gains two two. What's nice is it keeps track of it for you as well. Because heaven help me, I wouldn't be able to remember. He kind of looks like me, but only a he. Thanks, well. See, so keeps track. The little bobbles keep track. Well, you know, in World of Warcraft, Blood Elves were probably my favorites. They were so. I have a Blood Elf Paladin, Priest. I got a bunch of them. I always liked Kael'thas, and when I was playing Warcraft 3 Reforged, the story is so sad about how they were treated. It was so sad. A Blood Elf Pally! I love it. Oh my god, like, have any of you guys played Warcraft 3? So I was playing Reforged, and wow, like, Arthas and Kael'thas, I felt so bad, and it made me so, so sad how all of these characters were treated. And Sylvanas! Oh my gosh! Baby girl, no wonder she's so evil. She had it so bad. You know? Ugh. Oh. Broke my heart, guys. Broke my heart. Okay, so this is another jewel. We're talking about Warcraft 3. So I think we're talking about the story before WoW. That's what we're talking about. Um, all right, so we're gonna buy he something here, and then the next one we get is gonna have a 2-2, right? So I like this. So we'll freeze because what I'm thinking is, so see the third one is gonna be a two two. So what we could do is now that I have the rabid Papegasaur, because I call him Papegasaur, is I'm planning on grabbing both of these death rattles. So whichever one I grab is going to have plus two plus two. <laughs> but yeah, Warcraft 3 goes through all the backstory of everything, which was neat. Because I played I played Hots, and obviously I played World of Warcraft and Hearthstone, but I never got like the backstory so it was really neat being able to play that and that's another game i haven't even finished yet but i really like the story it was so good all right what do we want to buff up do we want to buff up this guy so we're gonna grab him Ew, spinny so now he's a five five and he makes my dude grow i like it okay There we go. And now what is Finley has pyramids hero power. Okay. So this is my first time playing Kalthos in Battlegrounds. I've been wanting to play him because I think of the three between Kalthos, Lady Baj, and Maeve, his hero power seems like it's the best. So I've been wanting to play that. And we finally got it. Um, 29.3% chance to win. Oh, we got the tie! We got the 47% tie. Isn't that wonderful? <laughs> okay, we have another... Another Papega. 
we'll level up. We'll grab uh, we'll grab another Pepega. So next one we grab is going to be a 2-2. Two -two. Okay, so at least we'll we'll be on tier three as well. So what about you guys? Has anybody else played that? I thought the story was so good. A lot of people I talked to that played Warcraft 3, they played a lot of the was it the custom the custom maps? Like the custom games, right? Not a lot of people I talked to had played the like the story mode or enjoyed the story mode like I do. So I think it's neat when I find that you guys do. Okay, 100% chance to win! No, we haven't played Classic WoW in a while. I have so many games I'm playing right now. I have so many games I'm playing right now. All right, so this next one is going to be a 2-2. I actually think we're going to grab... Mech 2-2. Okay. I think Hangry is going to be... We're going to make that a 6-6. I'm hoping that that's going to keep growing. Oh, another one of you. All right. That's going to buff up these guys as well, too. Okay. Okay. So we got a six. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to go six, 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 four. Dragons. All right. We'll try this. We'll try this out. Yeah, the lore is really, really good. The lore is so good in Warcraft 3. I really am enjoying it a lot. 69.4% chance to lose. Yeah. I'm I really like it a lot. I uh, have to go back and finish it as well. Oh, we lost by one minion. That's okay. We lost by one minion. Do I have any anything that's something that we do not, but we do have you that can buff up these guys. We're playing against Yogg with Murlocs. Alright, so got the dragons of 4-3, that's good. scares her except mice no we gotta switch there we go okay so what i'm thinking is we're gonna grab this i would like to buff up again and uh try to buff up these guys as well too 92 percent chance to lose does the game not know i'm trying to feed hangry oh that was kind of bad for us that uh hydra got the shield that was a bit bad for us. Okay. Ah, oh, we lost by a Hydra. Lost by a Hydra, it's okay. So have you guys tried any of the new heroes and who are you liking? Are there any heroes you're liking in particular? Sorry. 
It's gonna get buffed up here than these guys are, huh? The 2-2. Two, two. All right, probably want maybe like a bigger wolf. This is what we're gonna do. Let's um, let's beat, beat you up. And what'll be nice is this gets buffed and it also buffs these guys, right? So that's pretty nice. There we go. All right, let's shift this. Okay. Don't really have any mechs right now. I'm not sure if this person died or if they left. We want to get some four turns to go. I guess we'll just have to see. So this is the first time I get to play Kael'thas. I actually haven't played any of the new heroes yet. Right now, I think it's only available to people that have the pass. Okay, so this person just left, I guess. Person just left because all they have is uh, them. Okay, what are we up against? We're up against Murlocs. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, Granny. Oh, this will be nice. This will buff up a couple things. Do we want that buffed up, maybe? Like that one actually Here's roll once more. Trip. What do we have here? Oh, we get another one, huh? Okay. Nice. Okay, I was good with either of these. I think that's fine. So this is gonna grow. Nice. And then we're gonna roll. Okay. Nice, beautiful. Okay. I don't really know what they have here. Okay, so we do have, we got a selfless, we got a couple things here. I don't really know if it's worth, um, I don't really know if it's worth freezing, though. Look at my Papegasaurs! They're growing! These guys are definitely fed. They're definitely not hungry. Definitely not hungry. That might go eventually. I'll have to see what we could find, but she may end up going. So I always find this so interesting that Bob's buddy still doesn't work because of the uh, the secrets. Doesn't give you a percentage on it. So we win. So I guess we'll see if it's ice block, which it probably is. It's most likely ice block. That it is, yeah. Because I think if it did something, like, it wasn't going to lose, like, you would know that it was Ice Block, most likely. Alright, we can get more buffs here. That's nice. Melox. Alright. Give a beast two two. Hmm. Actually, I actually think we're just you know you know what though? Do we want a tons off the big boy? I mean we got this, right? Alright, I think we're gonna do this. I think we'll grab another hangry. Okay. Alright, we'll try this out. So 
so the green circles are his passive hero power. So it's Verdant Spheres. And what ends up happening is every third minion you buy gains 2-2. Two, two. So it kind of keeps track for you. Because if you had to kind of keep track for yourself of how many minions you're buying and which one's going to get 2-2, two, two, that would probably get annoying. Considering you're focusing so much on trying to play the game, right? So what'll happen is each time you buy a minion, each globe fills up, I guess. And then when you fill all three, the next minion you buy gets 2-2. Two, two. So it's really nice to have that, I think. I really like that. All right. Oof. See, so that just happened and we got this. And do we want a big boy? I mean, that's going to give us a five, right? So we could do, if we want to give that a little bit of extra oomph, we'll do that. So it's a 24 20. Beasts. That buffs him up there. Mechs, huh? All right. What if we get the Hydra in there? That's probably what we'll do. We'll go with the Hydra. Okay, we'll try this. <laughs> Actually, Corny, everyone calls me Lele, so they pretty much say that's me. That's that's right, because you've been gone from that game for a while, so yeah, everyone pretty much says that's me. Hi, Mage Lele. Because I was getting called Lele for a while. So we probably could use a taunt as well. I have a 62.9% chance to win though, which is nice. Okay. Doesn't really benefit from the uh, the wolf, which is good. Oh, my Hydra died, but we look uh... Okay. Are we all right here? Mm -hmm. We are! We're alive by one spider! <laughs> alive by a spider. How about that? I would like to taunt this up. So what are we at? We're at max, huh? Okay. Let's roll. Alright, so there's a taunt. That's nice. So next minion I buy is going to be 2-2, two, two, and there's nothing here. Oh, have I got- wait, have I got against this person seven turns ago? So we have no idea what this person has. Like, no idea. It's probably not a bad idea to top that guy up. All right, so if that's the case, I guess we're getting rid of Hangry. Okay. Try to block this a little bit in case they have like a swipe or something. Wildcat, they based her on you, only not as OP. I guess. <laughs> so funny, Wildcat. Wow, those are big bunnies. Look at the big bunnies. Those are some big bunnies. Okay. All right, so we uh, we get the tie, which is good. Get the tie. Big bunnies chat, holy cannoli. 
Um, alright, so there's another... There's another one of you. Don't we really want that at this point, do we? No, I don't have the bunnies. My bunnies weren't that big last time. We can use a... Use a beast. Granny? Alright, so this will get buffed up. I guess that's what we're going with. All right, this is what we're gonna do. I think eventually um, Hangry's gonna go, is what I think's gonna happen. Okay. So I think we're gonna shift like this. We kind of want to give some space for the Hydra, right? It's kind of, it's like a baby Hydra though. So we probably, we need to do better. Yeah, my bunnies definitely weren't as big as those bunnies last time we played bunnies. <laughs> and what's the last time against Yogg? Six turns ago. Yogg is living on the one HP and a dream, chat. One HP and a dream. Oh, he's got bigger hydras. Okay. Oh, that's so bad for us that that got shielded. That's just so bad. Okay. I mean, there's a lot of stuff there, so we're not going to get through that. And you could build the ultimate deck. That would be something, right? That would indeed be something. All right, we got the draw. No, we didn't. They got one Hydra. Oh, that's so funny. Got that 26.8% loss. Top four. I'm okay with that, considering it's our first shot with Kael'thas. I think I'm okay with that. All right, we'll grab another Hydra. <laughs> Friendly Beast 2-2. Two, two. that that ended up being the one that um, got buffed. That's a little unfortunate. All right, we'll try this. Marga, hello. <laughs> Comes back as Lele. Ah, that's a loss. That's okay. Like I said, I'm okay with top four with my first shot on Kale Boss. I think that was okay. So I think no matter what we did here, because he has full poison, there was kind of, there was nothing we could do here. And that's okay. That's quite okay. I'll take that. All right. So we actually got third. Very nice. We got third with Kael'thas. Very good. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed our video, you can catch us live on twitch.tv slash Nation four days a week on Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 5.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and Saturday mornings at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Come on by and be part of our community and we'll see you there.